All right, this is that guy in the right, and this is Let's Play Resident Evil on the Wii. In the last episode, we got back to the mansion and found out it's now infested with something worse than zombies. Hunters. And these things hurt. Badly. But we're going to head down this way. Back into this room, like I said we would be. Luckily, this is not a game where I can be like, Yeah, we're going to head down this way because... <laughs> Grab a red herb for a cure-all. No. I want the red herb. Yes. Thank you. And there we go. 100% health and it will cure poison. There we go. So, got the helmet key. And we open the door. And get that. Open the door, get on the floor. Everybody, holy shit, it's a fucking zombie. And this room. This room is a lot different than, uh... <laughs> Than the uh, PlayStation version. In this room, you would be fighting Yawn again, but they decide to add a new room, a new puzzle, and all that. Oh no, walls are closing in. But if, if you are behind the statue, it won't hurt you. So. And. There we go. What am I doing? What was I walking backwards for? Ah. <sighs> Okay, there's that. Okay, move. Move your ass. Press that switch, move your ass. And you're gonna wanna press the uh press this a little further. Yeah. Okay, we can't move it any further. So press the switch. Again. Okay, yeah, we can just use the uh C stick flip right around. Like that. Boom! And, oh. Just, it would help if I freaking ran right. And, uh oh. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Oh, I hate this puzzle. I really do. I honestly really do. It's over here. It's over on this side. Nope, nothing over on this side. Okay. I honestly hate this puzzle with a passion. Because the uh, nasty tank controls of the, of the original Resident Evil games make this puzzle a little bit of a pain. See what I mean? As soon as I start pushing it... Oh, okay, there we go. I thought I had to push it in. Okay, there we go. Okay, not so much of a pain. What's this? Battery pack. We're gonna need the head. If you notice, I've got the grenade launcher out because of the fight we're about to go into. Pull at your feet. Can't see very, very far through. Yeah, we will. Ooh. What is this? Take the last book, volume one? Yeah, we're gonna need that, actually. And examine it. This is part of getting into the last area of the game. Metal is hidden inside the book. Eagle metal. There we go. And... I can't get out. I have tried every possible way to escape, but only to be faced with the reality that I am trapped. I have been everywhere. The laboratory with the large glass tubes filled with formaldehyde in those dark, wet, eerie caves. What can I do? At first I didn't want to believe my eyes, but that familiar high Healed shoe in the corridor. It was like my ref it was like reflex. One one name came to my mind. Jessica. I don't want to believe that they share the same fate as me. No, I cannot give up hope. I have to hope they're alive. I haven't had anything to eat or drink for the past few days. I feel like I'm going crazy. Why is this happening to me? Why do I have to die like this? Was I too obsessed with designing this nast ghastly mansion? Should have known better. It was dark and damp on the ground. T it was a dark and underground, dark and damp underground tunnel, in another dead end. But my, but even my in the darkness, something came, uh, caught my eye. Carefully, it, I lit the last match I had to see what it was. A grave, but deeply engraved in the stone was my name, George Trevor. At that instant, it all became clear to me. Those bastards knew from the beginning that I'd die here, and I fell right into the trap. It was too late now. I'm losing everything. 
Losing it. Everything is becoming so far away. Jessica, Lisa, forgive me. Because of my ego, I got both of you involved in this whole damn conspiracy. Forgive me. May God justify my death in exchange for your safety. Yep, the final resting place of George Trevor. In this game, there's nothing on the gravestone, really. There's just a switch. You just press the switch. Boom. There we go. <laughs> Continue forward. <laughs> Bottom of the ladder, you get a cave system. Now, screw the spiders. And they spit on you. They still spit on you. Yeah, we don't. No, we don't. Okay. I thought we went that way. <laughs> oh. Hey, spider. <laughs> Spiders are your bros, man. Don't want to kill them. <laughs> and we're down here. And there's zombies down here. See? And I'm just quickly taking them out, because I don't want to deal with them. Yeah, I, I believe that kills them outright. Completely, so... We should be good. No, it doesn't. I thought it would make them at least explode a little bit. Okay, we unlocked it. Well, let's explore a little bit. Don't take a half hour, because these things are likely to become crimsons. Uh, luckily, we don't have to come down through here too much. There we go. We got the elevator running. And good thing I went through this way, because those things will be crimsons in a half hour's time. Huh. <sighs> Bloody hell. <laughs> I believe this is the kitchen area. Yep. And... Ew. I think we can avoid this zombie. Ooh. What? I said yes. Why did you say... Why did you make me say no? Okay. Yeah. We can just get around him. Easy. There we go. And there's one on the floor. Yep. And use the elevator. Yes, we will. Come on. And there we go. We go into the elevator. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. And there we go. Here we go, we're in the elevator. This is a special area of the mansion we've never been. Ooh. There's that guy. Well, oh, shoot. And nice little moth. Huh. Die. I shouldn't be using my rounds like that. I really shouldn't. You know, in all reality. Hey. And die, go down. And down. Hmm. Oh yeah, there's a storage room. Yeah, this is a storage room. And there should be something in here. <laughs> and do we have my shotgun? No, we don't have a shotgun. Oh, wait. We can grab this. Yep. Oh crap, this isn't good. I'm gonna need this. Huh. Yeah, I'm gonna need that to continue on. Oh, bloody hell. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, he's not dead. He's not dead. I want to go that way right now. He's still dead. He's still alive. Okay. Ah, shoot. You know what? Combine. There you go. This burns him. Can't go this way. Alright. Nope. Yeah. There you go. He won't be. He won't be turning crimson. Okay, now he won't be turning crimson. Damn it! Okay, that didn't hurt. 
quite as bad. I unlocked the door, and there we go. Okay, I thought this one would be a uh, one of those doors you have to get the code for. Oh shit, this room. Yeah, this room. <laughs> Alright, at least we have a shortcut to it now. Ah. Yep. Okay. Now we know where now we know where we are. We got a shortcut. Which means downstairs. It means at the end of this damn hall, it's gonna be a crimson. So Yep, there's one. I think there's two of them actually. Alright. There's the other crimson. I can see it in the mirror. Alright. It's gonna come. There we go. Took out the crimson. Ah, phew. Okay, there we go. That crimson's always standing in that spot, so. Don't need those. Ah, shoot. <laughs> No, where is... Okay, I'm going to end this one off right here. And I'm going to take some stuff to the uh, item chest. Uh, in the next episode, we will be working on trying to find Yawn. So, this is that guy on the right, signing off. Have a good day.